evening, everyone. Let's do this. That's the move out. We are off. On our way into... Actually, we're already in the Lightning Temple. Ooh. All right. Wife was asking me when we were going to have date night. So, I was responding. Do we need a torch? That was kind of fun. <laughs> I gotta do one thing real quick. There we go. <clears throat> oh, we do need a torch. Um, yeah, as cool as that is, I really don't want that. Mainly because the bees come after me. And that's annoying. Sorts of goodies. I was going to climb, and then I remembered this. You know that thing I keep forgetting about. <clears throat> no drinking for me tonight. Have work tomorrow. Plus, I kind of want to run tonight, so I'm only going to stream until seven. It's about another hour and a half. was that chat yeah well, that was just weird right like and then he fell over <laughs> I'm pretty sure he should not have fallen home, but he did. As tempting as that is, I don't know where I'm going to end up. I could end up in a bad place. Is off wind. These flames make it impossible to go further.
kind of forgot she could do that. Not because of me. I see. What? Fireballs now. Looks like we're stuck again. Wow. I'm gonna go with the bricks. So weird to me that she needs me to do that when we're that close. It's like pretty sure you can do it by yourself. <laughs> this is a hive. I'm pretty sure. Eventually that I'm gonna open. Whee. Hey, let's go. Mighty construct bow. Strong as a a sword. Ooh, Captain Three. Who thinks Hell's been that's gonna be bad? 
Haha, I knew it. Ow, fuck it. God damn it. Soldier Construction 3. <laughs> Sorts of secrets. Goodies chat. I thought I didn't need to come in here, but now I know I do. Actually, I probably could have done that just like this. Yeah, probably. Oh. Let's go! <clears throat> Up we go! How many more fairies do I have? The last thing I want is to die. I am out of fairies chat. Pretty sure. Nope, nope, I have two more. Room of Ascension. Good thing I have that ability. I think I'm certain that the mural we saw in town was trying to guide us here. I believe we'll also find whoever that voice we've been hearing belongs to. Wow, it is this place. Room of Ascension. Didn't you read the subtitle? Ooh, safe spot. <clears throat> That didn't work very well. Hey, the floor started to raise, then slam back down. It broke it. Creepy voice. Daughter, daughter of the Garuda. This platform connects to the very top of this temple. Use your power to charge the four batteries, and it will function once more. Heed my words. I heard the voice very clearly just now. It's calling to me. It said that I should use my power to charge the four batteries. I heard it too. Monster we fought outside earlier fled to the top of this temple. The voice that has been speaking to us said the platform should be able to take us all the way up there. 
If that's true, we could corner the monster at the top. He can fly. I don't think you really corner him. Especially not at the top of the, like a pyramid type temple. No. Why don't also figure out who was talking to us and why? Oh, Link, we need to get up to the very top. To start, we should do what that mystery voice, mysterious voice suggested and try to find those four battery devices. Yep. There's one. Lightning Temple, second floor. Need that for later. Blah. What? That's a shock for Duke. Um. Looks like we need to get in through the top. I think we're gonna need that eventually. Well. No way we need to shine it. We don't have any light yet. Third floor has a whole lot of fucking nothing. Fourth floor. Also a whole lot of nothing. Except for that. Friend can't come with us. Link just down in the shit ton of space figures. Yep, I'm dying. <laughs> Seems a little weird. Now every once in a while, light will come through. That 
very often, but long enough it seems to activate those. Found a button, chat. It's weird I can do stuff like this, but yesterday I was having so many troubles <clears throat> doing some of the, these puzzles. Oh this thing fuck! Is going to be a problem. Wrong one. Again, thanks to me. We're just going to do this. Damn it. No. Hmm. it here hmm. so that's not moving um That should unlock the other thing. Can we? I think I got. I think I just got like with that chat because eh, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to do that. What? Hmm. <laughs> Yep, that's what we were supposed to do, chat. Ow. Hmm. There you go. Oh, come on, I'm like slightly off. Yay! First battery. What? Wait, wait. One battery charged. 
Here you go. So this is one of the batteries. It seems to have absorbed my lightning well enough. All right. A lot of electricity and lightning. Where's my my line? Where do we get to go? It's technically you can always come back. Battery. Need that light to hit. Where was it? Hmm. Ah, there. Hmm. That is the easier way to do that chat. Just slightly dumb now. Isn't there? Damn it. Where there is a yeah. So we need to balance that. Here. Hmm. Went through. Oh, oh, no. Oh. I'll leave that area to you, Link. <laughs> That's something that'll <laughs> shift light a different direction. I want to move. God damn it. Seventh floor. Um, yeah, we need her with us for this. Need to figure out how to get her up there. Oh, I'm an idiot, Chet. I 
I feel dumb, chat. It's like, fine, I just want to fucking move it. I had the power to move it the whole time. With my mind! I got really good stuff. So that'll be able to bounce light down. Okay, now it's bouncing light. Has the height. Oh no, it doesn't. Ray. Swim through rock. Just push a button. Which gets me. If I go I don't think I'm supposed to be able to do that. I don't think it's wrong per se. Alright, we need to shift that one. This time we're going to shift not this one to this one. They left their bow in that corner. After I killed them. So close. This is called the Lightning Tower or Lightning Temple. But it's more about light. 
Room of Offred Light. I need you. Wait, no, no, no. Stop. Thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Got light there. Now where does the light need to go? Is the question. Zoom up here. <laughs> Alright, what we're gonna do is shit. Attach that to there. Attach that. This. Haha! -ha. 
What? Come on, I have that. There you go. It's probably not the best way to do that, but... Ow. Why? Fused, why? Anyway. Do 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 do. <clears throat> Three down, one to go. Only one more battery to go. We need to eat food. Better would probably would have been to attach one of those to like each corner, stick that on top of it. <sighs> or something like that. Who knows? As long as it works. That's all that matters. This is on the first floor. So we need to get in there. Examine. I did that chat. Is that examined? I examined. Hmm. I gotta think chat. Oh, oh. Alright, we're in. Where the fuck did she come from? Literally, what the fuck? She's kind of like fell out of the sky. All right, we've charged all of the batteries with that yeah. of the mechanism in the center. Ah, oh, god damn it! Here's technically she can just come in there. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. 
I really shouldn't have done that. Oh, hi. Which will get us up to the top, which is where that creepy ass room with the uh, four hives was. What is? I think, I think this warp from is about to move. Yeah, that's what it does. It's an elevator. Hmm, something shining over there. What is it? Room of glorious light. Ready, ready. Open the door. Back. Here you the lightning temple. Let's go. We'll finish it off here and now. First, we need to destroy. We've got it cornered. Get ready. Please. Ow, motherfucker. Catch the dead bodies of her dead children. Come on. There you go. Bop. Show me what you can do. Um, seven, thirteen. Now she's gonna have her babies come help. Oh shit! I'll try not. You gotta help though. Fuck me! Um, Gertie, need your help with something. Okay, 
wait for it. Ow. Not even close to what I wanted. Fuck me. Alright, that was loud. What? God damn it. King, king, king. Be useful, please. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, chat, trying to concentrate. No, 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 uh, uh. She's ready again. Run over here. There you go. Now they're all dead. Ow. Bodies of her dead children. Strength of my weapon. That that's not like super heavy. I mean, it's huge. Ow. 
wait for it. La! First try! Supposedly, whatever I get from this is gonna make the rest of the game so much easier. Probably get her to come with me. Which would make the game insanely easy. Ooh! Free heart piece! Looks like we're going stamina for a bit. Ho ho ho! One of them things. Hooray! What is that? He's <laughs> drunk and went right towards her. Is he going to talk to her? Uh -huh. Last time somebody we knew touched one of those. Beloved daughter of the girl disappeared. Uh, I know that voice. You are the one who's been talking all this time. Yes, your ancestor from a time long past. I was a Garuda warrior who served the first king of Hyrule and a sage who called down lightning, just as you can. I've seen you brandish the power you have in defense of our people. I would expect nothing less from my descendant. You are the pride of the Garuda. The Demon King is responsible for sending the monster that caused the Sand Shroud. But the monster's true purpose was to prevent you from obtaining that stone. My secret stone. Demon King? Secret stone? <laughs> Don't worry. You will understand soon enough. Let me tell you of events in our distant past. The events that shaped our people's destiny during the imprisonment. Long, long ago, when the kingdom of Hyrule was still young, A great evil, the Demon King, emerged. He attacked the innocent and sought the destruction of Hyrule. He was our chief before he changed. His obsession with power transformed him into a monster. Raru, the first king of Hyrule, and six warriors rose to oppose him. I'm proud to have been one of them. We faced the Demon King, but only after Raru gave us the means to fight the monster. Secret stones, artifacts that amplified the abilities of those who carried them. I, the Sage of Lightning, fought by my fellow sages in battle with my own secret stone. But we were no match for his overwhelming power. He endured our strongest attacks. Even the lightning strikes I called down. King Raru knew we had lost the battle against the Demon King. He made the ultimate sacrifice to imprison the Demon King, to seal him away. That was the imprisoning war. The rest of us survived that historic battle. Not long after, a visitor came to me, and she set the Gerudo on our destined path. Another of the six sages, the Sage of Time. The magic restraining the Demon King will eventually be undone. When that time comes, you must help Link. He is a noble swordsman who will fight that monster. So please, he will need your assistance. 
Lend him your power. The Gerudo's control of lightning. The path of the Gerudo was clear at that moment. We wish nothing more than to eliminate the Demon King. We are responsible for his very existence in this world, and for that we must make amends. I swear to you that when the Demon King returns, the Gerudo Sage of Lightning will awaken once more. The Gerudo Sage and her people will fight alongside your swordsmen. And now I have told you all I can of the Imprisoning War, and of our people's destiny. You have saved Gerudo Town, but the Demon King still remains a threat. Riju, daughter of the Gerudo. You must take up my secret stone, and honor the vow I made to the Sage of Time long ago. Fight alongside the Swordsman, Blink. So it's my destiny to fight by your side. <sighs> my destiny as a sage, my duties as chief, and fighting side by side with you? <laughs> Sounds like fun. I will gladly strike down the so-called Demon King. I guess it's time to claim my destiny! Use that ring to call upon my power, whenever you need it. <laughs> it seems I can finally repay you. Okay, should we head back to town?
Alright, I'm gonna go grab a drink. It'll be right back. One second. I'm Fortunately, all I have left is butter. I have no alcohol. <laughs> I am grateful to you for helping me save the Gerudo. We received reports that ever since the Sandtron dissipated, Gibdo attacks have almost entirely stopped. They're allergic to light. Oh. It will no doubt take some time to rebuild, but it is thanks to your help that we can live on the surface again. On behalf of all the Gerudo people, thank you. Oh. Mm. I'm sorry to say, though, that despite the safety of Gerudo Town no longer being a pressing concern, we still haven't been able to uncover any information on the whereabouts of Princess Zelda. Actually, Boliara, I do have a small piece of information regarding Zelda. I experienced a vision when I took the secret stone in my hand. The person that my ancestor referred to as the Sage of Time looked identical to Zelda. But it'd be impossible for that person to be Zelda, wouldn't it? Hmm. hmm. My ancestor claimed to have been from the distant past. It's just not possible for Zelda to be in that era. Hmm. Hmm. Pay me no mind. I'm just thinking out loud. She was the sage of time. I'm sorry, Link. Although the threat of the Sand Shroud and the Gibdos has passed, I cannot leave Gerudo Town at the moment. Things need some time to settle. However, we will take on the task of searching this area for any signs of Zelda. <clears throat> With my newfound power as a sage, I will still be able to support you. But I swear that I will do anything I can to help. Vow of Riju, Sage of Lightning. Proof of the Vow of Riju, Sage of Lightning, use it to summon or dismiss the Avatar of Riju. I hope your travels bring you back here again, Link. I look forward to such a reunion. Yep. Fuck. I really need to stop yawning. Ooh. Use that though. That's a question. Alright, we need to take a photo chat. Pose the L or the L button. Will allow me to do that. It's being dumb. Yeah, one of those two is supposed to be photo. Oh, one second. <laughs> Come on. What?
Ah. Well, fuck me, chat. I figured it out. Yeah, I didn't figure it out. I read how to do it. First, do, do, do. We need that. Second, we need to go. Here. And that's how we do it. Gotta go talk to this dude underground, and then he unlocks photo mode. Which is just silly. I mean, it is called camera work in the dark depth, so. Silly, but makes sense. Hmm. Yu Ju Vao has granted you the power to summon her avatar. Uh -huh. So she's always with me. Yeah. No, traveler, don't do it. If you touch that, well. It'll sap your strength, and you'll end up like me, too sluggish to move. Dude's looking down holes again. It's a big deal, you can't just walk up to someone who's staring, staying at the edge of a chasm. My colleague who works with me on the cell dive survey team is down there. What would happen if I slipped and fell on him? Huh? Huh? Don't start me again. Deep in my investigation work at the moment. We he he ho he he he. Hey, okay, that's how we can get back up. Ah, where you think? Please, pleasure to meet you. I am Ponic from the Sonai Survey Team. Robbie told me to guide you to him once you arrived, uh, but you rushed along with him in such a haste that he didn't bring enough bright bloom seeds. Now I've run out. So I lost sight of him. Oh. Thought he was taking a short walk over to that glowing area over there. Then he just kept going. And going. And last I saw him, he was heading way out there off to the west. Do you have any bright bloom seeds? I do. Oh, oh that's greatness. Light from the surface doesn't reach down here, as you might have noticed. You'd be wish risking your life to wander here without a light source, you know? You can usually get bright bloom seeds from caves and they'll light up if struck. So you're pretty so they're pretty easy to use too. You use the seeds all the time on the Sonai survey team. The simplest way is to throw them with your hand. Oh. Those of us skilled enough with a bow will attach into arrows and power them off to the distance down here. Oh. We're going to explore the depths, take plenty of those seats with you. Hmm. Bright bloom seat, bright bloom seat. Where the fuck are my bright bloom seats? That's a fruit. Probably had them, I just skipped past it. Hmm, maybe not. Oh, there we go. Oh, I didn't get anything from that. I was hoping I would. Anyway.
There's a shit ton more light down here. And stuff's growing. Shortcut. Debs. The fuck? Light real dispel the darkness and brighten the surrounding area. Now we got three different areas we can discover. We got the sky, the ground, and the depths. Alright, let's climb this. So we get across here. Flower. Okay. <laughs> oh, I, I was sincerely hoping it was attached to him. Bomblin horn, bomb flower, bomb flower. That leaf sword. Where's the rock? Especially when we're fighting against that. Aha! Room. It's just gonna make me blow shit up, aren't you? Stupid game. A bit further. Fuck.
You really need to make food. Really want the long stick actually. How are there no rocks down here? Fucking underground. Underground has rocks everywhere. What I want is a rock. Damn it. Break some of this stuff. Fuck me. I gotta get going to. Oh, we'll make our way to that next globe. Get our gloom removed. Right. Nothing good up here. a friend. Look how bright that thing got that night down in this dark is downright refreshing. Hmm, in fact, it's so luminous. It's almost like, like we're on the surface. Just standing near it makes me feel so much better. How strange. 
Hey, dude, you're finally here. I need to show you what I found. What? The statue is standing tall on two legs, one arm raised high. It looks an awful lot like the figure Josh uh, showed us in that piece of the slate, don't you think? Alright, get that camera of yours ready. It's time to put it to work. That's right, I forgot you hadn't used the camera when we last spoke. Very curious indeed, given it's one of pur the Purapad's basic features. Hmm, give me that Purapad for a second, alright? Well, there's the problem. Your camera's locked, and so see your Hyrule Compendium. Hang on. If I remember correctly, press this while you pull this, and then you tap that, and... Ta-da! Yay. Boom! Now you should be able to use both the camera and your Hyrule Compendium. So go capture a picture of that statue. This is a good chance to verify that it's working properly too. Because that experience is the best teacher after all. Once you've captured the image, come back here. I want to see how it looks. Aha! Uh oh. Okay. Like two seconds before the earthquake actually happened. Man, it's a decent big one. Oh. It's a pretty good one. Wow. It's not just up and down, it's kind of like left to right, back and forth. It's still going. If you captured the image of that statue with your camera, then hurry up and show me. I'd like to see how it looks. Oh, oh, still going. Did you get a good picture? I feel like it's still going. Stupendous. Looks like you've captured it well. I'm sure Joshua will be satisfied with this. Alright, earthquake's over. Lighting up that mint's root, getting you a picture of the statue. Just started helping us search what's down here. Soon enough, we're going to have even more to investigate. Well, when it's time to head back up to the surface, see you at Lookout Lot. And don't make Josh uh, wait too long for that picture. Wait, this is for my wife. There we go. We can take pictures now. Everybody's my wife's on the train right now, and like everybody who was on the train just had their cell phones go off, like saying, Hey, earthquake! which sounds pretty scary. And she says it was pretty scary because you're just standing there, just kind of like mm, all of a sudden, yeah, that freak anybody out. Why does that work? One of my schools one day when that happened, something like that. I was in the uh, teacher's room and all of a sudden she's like, wait, 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 wait. Like half a dozen, no, like a dozen different teachers. Cell phones all went off at the same time. I was like, whoa, kind of scary. All right. Damn it. I am done for the night. Thank you everyone for watching. I will maybe. Be back tomorrow. Depends on how a how tired I am after the uh, sports day, and b what time I get off, what I eat before I go home, and whether or not I get drunk really fast.
So, I may or may not be on tomorrow morning. I will not be on tomorrow morning, though, because I have work. So, thank you everyone for watching. If you're watching this on YouTube, please like and subscribe.